learning to dislike, politely, master the art of, not a fan of, and, not into. Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we are going to focus on an exciting aspect of English conversational language, expressing dislikes. More specifically, we'll discuss the use of phrases, not a fan of, and, not into, and how we can use positive statements before them to sound more polite and diplomatic. Remember, learning to express your dislikes appropriately is as crucial as expressing your likes and maintaining healthy communication. Before we delve deeper, let's refresh what we've learned so far about expressing dislikes. Not a fan of, and, not into, are two common phrases used to express dislikes or lack of interest in a polite, and direct way. For example, 1. I'm not a fan of spicy food. 2. I'm not into action movies. Here, the speaker is clearly stating their preferences without being too harsh or direct. The real art of expressing dislikes is to start with a positive statement. It softens the negative comment that follows, making your conversation more pleasant. Take a look at this example. I love Italian food, but I'm not a fan of anchovies on my pizza. Here, the positive statement, I love Italian food, makes the following aversion towards anchovies sound less severe. Let's practice using some more examples. I enjoy reading, but I'm not into science fiction novels. I appreciate all types of music, but I'm not a fan of heavy metal. In each of these sentences, you express your dislike or lack of interest in something, but you also share a positive statement before it, which makes your overall statement sound polite and balanced. And that's it. Now, you're all set to express your dislikes in English more diplomatically, using the phrases, not a fan of, and, not into, preceded by positive statements. Keep practicing these structures and you'll become more fluent and confident in sharing your preferences. As always, we hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. Until next time, happy learning!